Hello everyone, I'm going to be going through my Blu-ray collection because of this lockdown that's in effect I thought now would be the best time to do something that one of my friends has been telling me to do for a very long time I'm very uncomfortable I'm uncomfortable I, I can't speak either um, because he's on my bed and I have nowhere to sit and do this and I'm kind of just leaning over now I'm also going to apologise if you can hear anything from either outside or inside my house, just in the background in general. And there won't be any editing because I am a poor college dropout. So, um, yeah, it's, it's, sorry about any mess as well. Um, Iron Man. Oh, damn it. I've never done this before. Um, Incredible Hulk, I'm just going to leave it like that. Lies in the name, it's not incredible. Iron Man 2, definitely the worst Iron Man film. Uh, Thor, a lot better than people actually give it credit for, except for the amount of canted tilts, those are pretty bad. Um, Captain America's First Avenger, pretty good. Uh, Avengers, it doesn't deserve to work, but it does, and it's just the perfect example of why casting matters. Iron Man 3, an underrated film in my opinion. Thor The Dark World, it, it's not good. Yeah, it's not good. Captain America The Winter Soldier, pretty good. Guardians of the Galaxy, Avengers Age of Ultron, I wish we had trailer Ultron. But yeah, it's not as bad as some people say. Atman, the most underrated MCU film in my opinion. I absolutely love it. Captain America Civil War. Doctor Strange. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, much better than the first one in my opinion. That's for some reason a very unpopular opinion, but oh well. Uh, Spider-Man Homecoming, pretty good film. Thor Ragnarok. Pretty popular opinion for it to be the best Thor film, and I agree. And this is where I need to start. Oh, okay. Black Panther, heavily overrated. However, I understand why it's so important to those people. Um, oh, this is this is a failure. Avengers: Infinity War, my favorite MCU film. Also, the very first film I actually pre-ordered. So that's a pretty fun fact. Ant Man: The Wasp. I really like this film when it was in cinemas, and now every time I rewatch it, I don't like it as much, and it keeps decreasing. And it's really sad because I actually really liked it. Captain Marvel, mediocre at best. Uh, Avengers Endgame, pretty good, not as good as Infinity War. Uh, Spider-Man: Far From Home, my favorite live-action Spider-Man film, and my favorite solo standalone MCU film. Um, I, yeah, I also have this, the uh, Spider-Man Legacy Collection. Sam Raimi Trilogy is pretty good. Uh, not hasn't aged well. However, it's still a lot of fun. You can't really go wrong with it. Yeah. Um, oh, sorry, sorry. Um, yeah, I haven't really done anything like this before. Um, now, before we get onto the actual, actual, oh shit, actual collection, I uh, have this. Pokemon Diamond Pearl DVD 4 movie box set. Uh, yeah, it isn't a Blu ray, so it isn't really part of the collection. And set one of the Persona 4 anime, which is both Blu ray and DVD, so it is part of it, but it's a regular DVD size case. So, um, on to the actual collection. Uh, 28 Days and Weeks Later. Really great films. Uh, 101 Dalmatians. A Night to Remember. A street cat named Bob. Ad Astra, haven't seen this one. Alien, haven't seen this one either. Yeah, I don't have an excuse. Alien Covenant, one of the last things I bought from HMV when I was going under. And you don't want your last thing to be Alien Covenant. Uh, Alita Battle Angel, haven't seen this one either, but. Eh. Aquaman, oh, I haven't seen loads of these. I need to get on that. Uh, Arrival. Uh, Attack on Titan Season 1. Uh, season 2. 
and Season 3 Part 1. Uh, I love Attack on Titan, haven't seen Season 3 yet. Uh, Baby Driver, Back to the Future Trilogy, love these films, even the third one. Uh, Batman Begins, Dark Knight, and Dark Knight Returns. Batman Ninja, I bought this because Roger Craig Smith is Batman. Uh, Beethoven, Blair Rich, I mainly bought this because of the other case and I put on swapping the case out with something but I haven't got around to it. Uh, Bohemian Rhapsody, Bonnie and Clyde, Bumblebee, Captain Fantastic, Casino Royale, Cats and Dogs, this is a guilty pleasure of mine from my childhood. I love it unconditionally, it's not a good film by any stretch of the imagination. Uh, Chernobyl, Child's Play, Christopher Robin, Daredevil Season 1, Daredevil Season 2, and it's a real shame that we're probably never going to see Season 3 physically. Uh, Deadpool, not as rewatchable as I'd love it to be, I, I'd like it to be, still really good though, but I prefer Deadpool 2. Uh, Death Note, The Disaster Artist, oh, this is... Oh, Doctor Sleep. I wish we got the American cover because this one's pretty bad, but it's still pretty good film. Uh, Doctor Who Season 1 on Steelbook. Series series 2. Series 3. Series 4. And the specials. I have Season 5 on Steelbook on the way. Uh, and Series 10. I love Doctor Who. Used to. I don't like it anymore. Uh, Christian Null killed it. Um, Sorry. No, uh, Doctor Nine. Oh, oh, I'm sweating. It's my exercise I've done. Oh, cool. Lockdown. Oh. Uh, Doctor Strange Love. Dunkirk. Fantastic Mr. Fox. This was my favourite film until 1917, which isn't out yet. Uh, Forbidden Planet. Friday the 13th. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Get out. The original Ghostbusters, I will I refuse to have the 2016 one. It isn't as bad as uh, most one reboots are, but yeah. Godzilla, the good one. King of the Monsters. Still pretty good. I thought this was really good. Uh, Goldfinger. Ugh. Oh this is oh I'm sorry about this. It'll be easier when I get shells eventually. Uh Goldfinger. Gremlins, Hacksaw Ridge, amazing film, Halloween, uh, the new Halloween, The Hateful Eight, Hot Fuzz, How to Train Your Dragon 1 and 2, haven't seen the third one, Independence Day, oh this is, this is, oh, oh no, this is an awful video, Inception, Inglorious Bastards, my favourite Tarantino film. Uh, the Iron Giant. Isle of Dogs. Uh, the Bad It. The Good It. It Chapter 2, nowhere near as good as uh, this one. But I still enjoyed it. It Follows, amazing. Jackie Brown, haven't seen it. John Wick, phenomenal. John Wick Chapter 2, even better in some capacity. And John Wick Chapter 3, which is my favourite one. Uh, Joker, absolutely love this film, except the fan base makes me ashamed to actually like it. Uh, Jurassic Park, Jurassic Park 2, Jurassic Park 3, uh, Jurassic World, I refuse to get the new one. Kick-Ass, Kick-Ass 2, yeah, Kill Bill, Kill Bill Volume 2. <laughs> King Kong vs Godzilla. Oh, oh well. Alien and Tramp, Le Mans 66, or Ford vs Ferrari. Uh, oh shit. Little Shop of Horrors. And Logan. They should, Fox should have not made Dark Phoenix. When's the ending for that? And I'm on the very edge of my bed. Oh god, this is, this is going perfectly. Whew, phenomenally. The Martian. Midway, Monsters Inc, 
Monty Python and the Holy Grail, one of the funniest films I've ever seen. Yeah, I want to get more Monty Python films. Uh, Natural Born Killers. Uh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Pacific Rim. Pet Cemetery. Yeah, and that's about that. Is the better is. Oh, I liked it. Detective Pikachu. Uh, the Pokemon, or the first Pokemon film. Uh, Power of Us. Predator. Pulp Fiction, which I think is criminally overrated. Psycho. The Purge. Anarchy. Election Year. And the first Purge. I love this collection of films. Uh, Anarchy is my favourite. It's a guilty pleasure of mine. Uh, Ratatouille. You, you need to have Ratatouille. Reservoir Dogs. Look at Morty Season 1 and 2 because I'm just uh, a big brain intellectual by the quality of this video that clearly shows. Shinner's List. Selma. Shaun of the Dead. I love this film. Shazam. Shin Godzilla, amazing. And, oh, sh <laughs> uh, The Shining. Skyfall. Speed. Spider Man Into the Spider Verse. SpongeBob, SpongeBob Water, which I think is actually now out of print. Uh, yeah. uh, the complete Star Wars saga, which um, I, I, I unironically love the prequels. And my legs beginning to hurt, so please be there with me. Ooh. Whew. This is physically taunting. Uh, Force Awakens. I like this film. Last July. It's a, it's a shame they haven't finished the trilogy. I think an episode 9 would do pretty well if they did it right. It's just, it's a shame they haven't made it. I mean, I mean there's... That awful fan fiction film by the Skywalker. Whew. Yeah, Th this is a pretty good end. I mean, I'm, don't get it's, it's not good. I don't like it. Rogue One, my favourite Disney Star Wars thing. Solo, if you uh, if you look at this as its own little film, it's pretty good. Sully, the original Ninja Turtles trilogy. The 2007 Ninja Turtles, Terminator, Terminator 2, Tokyo Ghoul Season 1, Top Gun, Toy Story 1, Toy Story 3, yes I am missing um, 2, and Toy Story 4, my favourite 3, Train Spotting, Transformers, Triple Nine, us. Venom, this holds a very special place in my heart. It's not a good film. But it's the first one I ever watched with friends. So, yeah. Uh, Vertigo. Wally, my favourite Pixar film. Wanted. Watership Down. The World's End, my favourite of the um, Conrad trilogy at the moment. It, it constantly changed between the three of them. The complete eight film collection of the X Men. Excluding. Dark Phoenix, because I don't like that one. It ruins the ending that Logan gave. Uh, you know, and... Zombieland. I would be surprised if you stuck around with me whilst going through this mediocre collection, but if you have, I thank you greatly. And, uh, yeah, sorry for putting you through this amount of torture. Anyway, farewell.